Oh, buddy, have you gone down the rabbit hole of the Elon Musk and the BBC interview? I'm going to show you a couple of clips, and they're amazing. Here we go. I see more hateful content in that. In that content way. you don't like or, or hateful? What do you mean to describe a hateful thing? Yeah, I mean, you know, just content that will solicit a, a reaction, something that may include something that is slightly racist or slightly sexist, those kinds of, those kinds of things. So you think if I'm, something is slightly sexist, it should be banned? I, no, is I'm that not, what you're saying? I'm not saying anything. I'm well, saying... I'm just curious. What you, I'm, I'm trying to understand what you mean by hateful con content. And I'm asking for specific examples. Um, and, if, and you just said that if something is slightly sexist, that's hateful content. Does that mean that it should be banned? Well, you've asked me, you've asked me whether my feed, whether it's got less or more. It, I'd say it's got slightly more. That's but, why I'm asking for examples. Can, right. you, can you name one example? I, I honestly don't use, I, I, honestly, you I don't. You can't name I, a single example. I'll tell you why, because I don't actually use that for you feed anymore, because I, I just don't particularly like it. But you said actually, you, a, lot of people, a lot of people are quite similar. I, 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 only, well, well, I only look well, at my Well, hang on a second. You said you've seen more hateful content, but you can't name a single example, not even one. I'm not sure I've used that feed for the last three or four weeks. And I, well, I, then I how did you see the hateful content? content? Because I've been, I've, been using, I've been using Twitter since you've taken it over for the last six months. Okay, so then you must have at some point seen the, you, for you hateful content. I'm asking for one example. Right. And, and you I, can't I, give a single and, one. And, and, and I'm saying... I, I, then I, I say, sir, that you don't know what you're talking about. Really? Yes, because you can't give me a single example of hateful con content, not even one tweet. And yet you claimed that the hateful content was high. Well... That's a false. No, what I claimed, you just lied. What, no, no, what I claim was uh, there are many uh, organizations that say that that kind of information is on the rise. Now, whether, whether it has on my feed or not. Give me one example. Not, I mean, I, right, and Literally if you, you look at something one. like the, the uh, Strategic Dialogue uh, Institute in the, in the UK, they will say that. So you, they, look, people will say all sorts of nonsense. I'm literally asking for a right. single example, and you can't name one. Right, and as, as I've already said, I don't use that feed. But let's, well, then how let, would you know? That I don't you, think this is getting anywhere. You literally said you experienced more hateful content and then couldn't name a single example. Right, and as I said, I, That's haven't, absurd. I, haven't, I haven't actually looked at that feed. I then how would you know this hateful content? Because I'm saying that's what I saw a few weeks ago. I can't give you an exact example. Let's move on. We, have, we only have a certain amount of time. So this dude obviously just can't stand Elon Musk. He is so triggered, it's ridiculous. The whole time, his body language and just the way he's talking to him, he's trying to talk down to him. But Elon just plays it cool. The dude is good. And he's not a not one of the rich, no, top two richest men in the world because he's not intelligent, because he's not cool, calm, and collected, but he just owns him. He does it again right here. Um, wow. COVID misinformation. You changed Amazing. The COVID, you've changed the COVID misinformation. Has rules. BBC changed this COVID misinformation? The BBC does not set the rules on Twitter, so I'm asking you. No, I'm talking about the BBC's misinformation about COVID. Sorry, got to jump in here real quick. The first one to speak loses. That's a common tactic to use in sales. Elon does it again. I'm, I'm, I'm literally Has, asking you about, you changed the labels, the COVID misinformation labels. They used to be a policy, and then it then disappeared. Why, why do that? Look, COVID is no longer an issue. Does the BBC uh, hold itself at all responsible for misinformation re regarding ma masking and, and side effects of vaccinations and not reporting on that at all? And what about the fact that the BBC was put under pressure by the British government to change its editorial policy? Are you aware of that? This is, a, this is not an interview about the BBC. Oh, so. you thought it wasn't? <laughs> and this, I he got steamrolled again and again and again. You need to go watch this entire interview. It's Elon Musk, BBC interview on YouTube. You can find it. It's about an hour long. Absolute must watch. Go watch it.